Welcome YouTube. This is the Velvet Locks with another wonderful video. Okay, this is a weight loss update video, and of course, you know by the the looks of my face, it looks as though she lost a little bit more weight. Okay, yes, I have. So I want to come back here just to share with you what I've been doing, updating you on this wonderful way that I have been naturally dropping my weight. And just to encourage you all that are on your weight loss journey that are doing the same thing to let you know you got to stand in it. You got to stick with it. Now that I've gotten back completely on my weight loss journey, my whole mindset is different. All right. I got back my mojo. I got back my mojo, all right? Which means now my mind is focused into losing this weight. In my previous video, uh, weight loss update, I lost five pounds. Now that was within a week, but I lost five pounds. Well, I'm coming back again to share with you that with all that I've been doing, drinking that concoction drink that I mentioned to you in that last video, that's what's been helping me. That's been helping me along with the changes that I've made to really get rid of this 10 pounds. Now, it doesn't work unless you change your eating lifestyle. So that's also something that I've been doing. Now, I have dabbled here and there with some of that processed foods that I tell you all the time not to eat. But you know, we all human, so... Mm. So, okay, this is what's been going on. Like I mentioned, in my morning routine, it's just liquids. In the morning, I'll have that detox concoction right before I have my morning green smoothie. Then throughout the day, I may have more, of course, I have my lemon water teas, my detox lemon water teas with the ginger. That is a wonderful detox tea that's gonna help you to drop that weight immediately you're going to be flushing and peeing your brains out. So please check that video out. That concoction really works. Along with the lemon uh, cucumber concoction drink, those are wonderful detox remedy teas that's going to drop that weight. So don't forget, check those videos out for those, uh, for how to mix that drink. And it's so simple. And all you got to do is drink it. That's it. Just drink it. And you're going to start to see your body shedding off that weight. Now, you're not going to see it overnight. But if you continuously keep drinking those drinks, you will see a difference. So along with drinking my aloe vera, honey, ginger, that drink right there, along with drinking that detox drink in the morning. Now, I drink that on an empty stomach. And then I drink that again later on in the night, twice a day. That's it. And in between my days, I usually load up with my other detox teas, detox drinks. I try to give myself lots of fluids and as well as nourishment uh, and vitamins from my green smoothie. Maybe in the afternoon around lunchtime, maybe late afternoon, I will have a meal. I choose to have my meals early so this way when I'm laying down at night, I am not laying down on a full stomach because of course you gain weight after you eat and lay down. So I try to give myself enough time earlier on in the day to burn that food off before later on in the evening now drinking my last detox tea as well as maybe having an evening snack. So I've been on a really strict eating regimen to really get this extra weight off. Now I gotta say this much, even though it seems that it's really strict, I haven't had much of an appetite. My cravings have gone. My appetite has really decreased. And it's really hard now for me to really eat more than half my portion. So I'm back on my mental focus of portion controlling. And that means I got myself to the point now where I can't even eat past half my portion. I'm very picky and finicky now where... If I want to eat something outside, fast foods, it's a constant battle as to what are you going to eat. Because you don't want Popeyes, you don't want Burger King, you don't want McDonald's, you don't want this. And a lot of times, I don't even want the, the heavy Caribbean meals, foods that's out there. So I try to think of different things, different healthy things that I can eat. A lot of times, I may go with the safe mode and I may just have a salad. Okay, a jerk chicken salad, which is fresh breast, uh, jerk chicken breast chopped up over a nice bed of 
lettuce tomatoes and the whole nine i may have that or i may have soup like the other night i had a big thing of soup now this was homemade from the restaurant but for some strange reason i just wasn't feeling it i didn't really want to eat it so i only ate a small portion of that so like i said my appetite has become very picky now and very choosy because i have been eliminating all of their processed foods at least most of it i dabble here and there and if i do dabble if I go to Popeye's, mm, I'm telling my secrets now. If I go to Popeye's, I'll have some chicken and maybe a little mashed potatoes and gravy and coleslaw. And that's it. And that's early enough in the evening so that this way it can be burnt off. And later on in the evening, I'll drink my detox drink, my de detox tea, my concoction tea to help burn off all of that stuff that I just finished eating. But that's how I keep myself from... I don't know. Well, that's what I do. That's what I do. And I can tell you this much. I have lost weight. Now, I have lost a total now of 10 pounds. So I have definitely accomplished my 10-pound weight loss challenge. I think I can still lose a little weight, but I'm not going to lose it continuing to drink the tea although I may limit myself now to just maybe one time but I'm still going to drink my lemon detox teas my cucumber water teas because those really 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 work um as far as my morning and evening routine I may do that but I think now that I have lost the 10 pounds I want to focus now on shaping up the pooch area even more now my size my clothes have definitely gotten looser and um my face has definitely gotten a little smaller so i can tell yes i have lost the weight another thing that i've noticed is like i said my eating habits have changed there's smaller portions now i'm very very finicky and picky and choosy about what i want to eat i try to limit and eliminate all of the fat stuff although i may have a small a very small taste of something on the other side yeah but I don't eat that in excess. So therefore, I'm still able to stay on my journey. Okay? On my journey. And that's what you got to do, you guys. This is definitely a journey. It's a sometimes a roller coaster. But once you get your mind straight, you can definitely do it. My challenge now is drinking more water. As always, it's always been the water thing. So that's why I drink a lot of my teas and detox waters to give myself that hydration. So yes, you guys, I am officially 10 pounds off. And I'm going to list again everything that I've done on this and how to mix this detox tea that's gotten me to shed this. So in my next videos, you're going to start to see me doing more things to burn and melt the fat off just specifically in that area so i may even come back on here with some exercise routines things that will target just that area and build up that muscle in the abdominal area and still i've been wearing my waist trainers to keep my posture uh proper as well as tighten those abdominal muscles because it keeps things in and also keep my skin from stretching i guess outside you know like them trying to keep the the weight to you know shape and mold itself so it's like you know i'm trying to keep my pooch in put it that way okay so yes it's definitely effective you guys this detox drink really works so for those of you who are on the brags stick with the brags the brags is a wonderful weight loss aid it's helped me to lose 50 pounds with no exercise but if you're not in you know if you don't really care for the taste of the brags here's another alternative that you can lose still the weight that you are choosing to lose with either out exercise or just choosing to lose the weight what i've what i've been doing to lose this 10 pounds and i shed it off just like that okay it may have seemed a little a long for some of you but really to shed weight off fast it can 
you don't want to shed weight off too fast okay that's unhealthy so even though it may have been three weeks that it took me to get off the 10 pounds that's more of a healthier way of shedding it because you're not doing it overnight like some of these crash diets so at least this is another form and way that you can safely lose the weight now this is the perfect time you guys to get on the bandwagon to get on your weight loss journey it's winter okay winter's coming this is fall it's clothing season so as you're putting on all those layers of clothes especially New York okay if you're over here on this side of town you're gonna need your layers well let me just say this much this is the perfect time to get on your journey perfect time to start your weight loss journey perfect time to lose that weight because when summertime comes that's when showtime okay and you reveal by shedding off all of that weight all, all those clothes you reveal that you have lost your weight perfect time to be on your weight loss journey okay so get on your journey right now and as always I am so happy that, you know, you all joined me. I'm so proud of all of you that's mentioned that you're on your journey, that you've lost your weight. Keep those encouraging responses coming in because there's so many of us on this that are trying to lose this weight, that need that extra boost of knowing there's somebody else out there that's doing it. And yes, they've done it, okay? So encourage, you, encourage each other down below. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video.